I was born and raised in Atlanta, and when I was three years old, I would sing in the back of the car to songs. Singing was what I really wanted to do. A week ago, your child is healthy, and the following week, you're this close to losing her. Her heart was starting to lose function. Her liver was starting to lose function. It was, it was spreading, it was getting bad. We just kept the faith and just said, you know, she's gonna pull through this. I was very scared and very sick. Just going through what I went through was really hard. I saw her with a bunch of tubes in her body. I told Angelica at that time that I love her so much. Keep fighting and don't give up. Cause I, I don't know what to do if I lose her. So Angelica, while she's on ECMO life support, you know, she, her kidney stopped working. She was actually in kidney failure at this time, and her kidneys never came back. And you know, we got we came to the realization that her life is forever changed. Her bedroom basically turned into a little mini dialysis clinic, where we did the dressing changes, where we hooked her up to the machine, and she's on that machine for ten hours every night. We came to the decision that, you know, this isn't a way to live your life. If you can get a kidney, if you can get off of this dialysis machine, do it. So we got tested, and I wasn't a match, but my wife was. Just that moment when I finally knew that I was free from that prison was the, one of the best days of my life. Any parent, you know, would do the same thing to save their kid's life. The big ask is when you ask someone to save your life. The big give is when they say yes. My mom gave me the big give. She gave me a big give. She gave me her kidney, and because of that, she is a part of me now because I have a piece of her in my body, and she's my savior. I love her so much. <laughs> After Angelica got her kidney transplant and got her life back, she's been on this incredible trajectory in, in life, and wonderful new opportunities have opened up. She's been on TV. She's just living life to its fullest, and all of this is made possible because of the kidney transplant that my wife gave to her. We're really proud of her. Even through all this, she didn't let that affect who she is, and that she still has this big heart and she's so loving and she'll tell you this but uh, her mother is her hero.